Good morning. Okay, so today's a really big day and get ready to hear a lot of beats because I just turned on the computer after having it off for a day. Um, so I'm getting a bunch of alerts. You know what? I'm just going to turn it off. But uh, yeah, it's about 15 minutes before I have to wake her up. I actually slept in because I was so tired yesterday. But today's a huge day. It's Ginevra's first day of junior, uh, no, senior kindergarten. Oh my god, my baby's in senior kindergarten. And um, we're doing our weekly uh, growth skin for Nato today. So I am going to do our, what I'm hoping to be, be our, my annual sign for Ginevra. I have to hurry up because if not, she'll be late. <laughs> but I already have her outfit picked up. I have nothing picked up for me. And I still have to wake up Nelson. Yeah, lots to do today. So let's get this done, shall we? What's today? School day. School day. First day of what? What grade are you in? Five. You're in grade five? Come on, they're ready for school. We're going to be late. Hey, Sana. Hey, Sana. Hey, Sana. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What grade are you in? Senior? Yeah. All right, let's go, monkey. <laughs> You ready for for kindergarten? All right, perfect. Good job. Okay, now hold up your sign. Tell Mama, what do you want to be when you grow up? You want to be a unicorn this year? Okay, we still have an animal theme. Mm. Mommy, Daddy, give it to you. Hold up, let me see. Don't switch on it. Okay? That means be smart. Be smart. <laughs> okay, so hold this. Hold this. Ready? Can you do it? Ready? Smile. Smile. Why do you want? Why are you wondering when the baby's gonna come out? Because I wonder. Oh, is it because Mama told you that the baby will come out after you start school? Yeah. <laughs> the baby will come out when the baby's ready. Mommy's gonna go to the doctor's today to check. That's why Auntie Katie's gonna pick you up. Okay. 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 That's why Mama goes every time to the doctor. Yep, to check if the baby's gonna come out soon. Oh yeah! Hopefully not. Oh yeah. It's heavy. You can do it. You can totally do it. I, I love you. I can almost do it. You can totally do this. Okay. So she never cried. She didn't cry once last year going to school. Well, the day before. Well, the day before she cried because she didn't want to leave. It wasn't because she didn't want to go. But I think it's like it's a combination of. The fact that yesterday was just such a tiring and emotional day, and then also because um, what's the other reason she is so tired today, like she's super sleepy. Oh, and last year her first day, it was quieter. It wasn't as chaotic in the morning. It was half day. Yesterday, half day. Last, 
Yeah, yesterday would have been a half day only for the JKs. The SKs would have been full day. So they would have had the SKs go in first. Um, and then the JKs would go in afterwards. Yeah. But yeah, poor monkey. And I think it's also the fact that I'm not picking her up. So I'm on my way now to the ultrasound and OB appointment. Fingers crossed that everything will be okay. I did put on a little bit of weight from last week to this week. So, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. It's not really about me putting on weight, it's whether or not I can get the baby <laughs> put on weight. So, we'll see. Hopefully it's better. I don't know if they're actually gonna be, I know they're not doing the full measurements today. Um, because my OB was saying that if there's not 10 days in between, they won't redo the measurements. So they'll only do something else. I guess I'll figure that out later. I haven't heard from the school yet, so I'm assuming that means that Ginevra calmed down after her, after her very upset episode this morning. I hope she's okay. Poor sweetie. She's probably just really, really tired and really really sad that her her teacher from last year wasn't there because I mean she absolutely loved Mrs. Temple and she loved her her teacher from last year um and not to say anything about this year's teacher I mean she seemed really sweet really nice and you know she took the time to get to know Ginevra and she skipped her up when we had to leave and things like that so it's good I'm just hoping that the tomorrow's drop off a little bit easier. I will walk her into the classroom tomorrow. I'll have her walk down the hall. So she should be okay. Just finished the ultrasound and they actually ended up having to do an internal one today, which is different. I've never had internal ultrasound done in my third trimester. So that was different. Um, and the cool, the, the thing is that, and I've also never had this option. They asked me if I want to insert the probe myself or for them to, for her to do it. And I was like, yeah, you do it. It's just, oh. <laughs> but she was so sweet. She was so nice, and and she explained everything. And, I, and I've had them done before, so it wasn't a big surprise. We didn't do any measurements today. They looked. She looked at the heartbeat, and his heartbeat is 140. So she said he has a nice strong heartbeat. And my cervix is still nice and long. And she said anything over three is good. And I'm at 4.8. So that's good. I don't know what it means. But all good news so far. So now I'm off to Dr. Chang's to find the results and get my way in and see what he says. Why I needed the internal exam this time was because the baby's head got bigger. I, I'm a, I, I think this is what it means. And so it's deflecting the ultrasound signals. And so she couldn't see my cervix. And so it wasn't a complete exam. So that's why she needed for me to do a an internal exam in order to check the length of my cervix. Yes, I thought that was the other interesting thing. Yeah, things you learn. I am finished from the doctors too. I finished the OB. And, oh my god, I've gained now too much weight. But the baby's good. The baby's doing well. This is so confusing. I can't find the right balance. I need to cut back down. My next appointment is on Monday. We're gonna do the actual uh, measurements at that time because it's too early to do measurements right now. And leave it at that. Okay, so we have a new communication folder this year. And I, I love the communication folders because there's like a keep side and a return side. I know exactly what I'm keeping and what I need to return. And so they have things about lunches. Oh, the snack bag. Oh, good, because I don't know. I couldn't remember when her classes started for Chinese school because we enrolled in Chinese school. Oh, today is my first day of school. Let's give a hip hip hooray. I have this little gift for you to help you through the day. A cup of tea to warm your soul, to com a kiss to comfort you, and just in case a tear escapes, there's a soft tissue. <laughs> so don't worry about me. I'm off to a great start. I may be out of your sight, but always in your heart. Oh, I love that. <gasps> what is it? That's so sweet. 
Oh, I love it. Huh? There's a bag of tea, two chocolate kisses, and a tissue. Oh, I love that. Why is there a tea? Okay, all right. So, ready? Let's cheers to the first day of school. Cheers. Your tea's over there. Your, your juice is there. Ready? Is it orange juice? Cheers. My favorite oranges. So tell me about your day. What did you learn today? Um, I learned math. You learned math? What kind of math did you learn? Um, I learned drawing myself. But that's math? Oh, okay, cool. So you drew yourself? And I colored all over my page. Ooh. And then I draw myself. Very good. And then was this, um, Mrs. P, um, Mrs. P, P, and Doe, um, she forgot to stamp mine. Oh, that's okay. Maybe she'll do that tomorrow. Well, I colored and then she said, go color. Oh, okay. When, when whoever gets the last, they don't need a stamp. Oh, okay. So she didn't stamp yours because yours was last? Oh, okay. Because I was working very busy. Oh. And did you have reading time today? What did you read? I didn't read anything. Oh, did? did I, just, I just looked at pages. Oh. And did you have to show the JKs anything? No. No? JK's did by their self learning. We went outside for one, for one, for two, and then I had lunch time. Uh huh. And then. And then. No star of day today. Okay. And there was lots of fun. Lots of friends. And you said you made a new friend that was playing basketball with you? Do you remember her name? No. But I, did I didn't met her before. Oh. I just um made um um got friends to her because we always partner in ball playing. Oh, playing ball. That's fun. And we was and we and we was practicing doing um basketball. Cool beans. We were, I was trying to, to catch it and following, but I couldn't do it. That's okay. You just need to practice because... Because that's right to do. Yes, it's the right thing to do. Excuse me. Oh, you're so excused. Next time, cover your mouth, please. Okay? Who are you? Who am I? I'm Mama. No, what are you... That's my... That's the camera. Well, who's in it? I don't know. I don't know at all. What we're going to do tomorrow? Go to school. A scan! Yeah, we're back to normal schedule. Lots of school. Uh, uh. <laughs> I wish I can do it next time. Nope, I'm going back to school. Mm. Ah. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Thanks for joining us on Ginevra's very first day of senior kindergarten and also for my latest growth skin update for our natto. See you next time. And don't forget. Jumps are in the sky. I'm, 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 I'm. Sorry, what did you say? I said I've. Yes, I know. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say. Thumbs up and subscribe and have a great day. Oh, that's cool. And, and, and have some great friends. Yay!